Prime numbers are numbers that can only be divided by one and itself. So when you have a number, let's say x, and the only thing that can divide x is 1 to give you x or x over x to give you 1. And any other thing that divides x, it will give you a decimal or a fraction as you may have it. So let's look at some examples to explain this point better. When you have number like 49 if you divide 49 by 1 it will give you 49 and if you divide 49 by 49 it will give you 1 but is 49 a prime number no because 49 can be divided by 7 and it will give you 7 so you need to be very careful don't just pick any number and just say the number can divide by can be divided by itself and can be divided by one, because all numbers can be divided by one and itself. But in addition to that, many other numbers can be divided by some other things. For example, four can be divided by two. Nine can be divided by three. Six can be divided by two. Or three. And a lot of other things like that. So, the condition is that, apart from one and itself, no other thing should be able to divide such number. So, if there is any number that falls into this category, so we can just say that that number is a prime number. Let's look at some examples. Like, 2, 3, 5, 7, 11, 13, 17, 19, 23, and so on. Apart from 2, that is even number. Even numbers are numbers that can be divided by 2 without any remainder. So apart from 2, that is even number. Every other prime number is an odd number. But not all odd numbers are prime number. For example, between 7 and 11, we have an odd number there, and that is 9. But because 9 can, can be divided by 3 to give 3, so therefore 9 is not a prime number. We also have 15. We have 21. They are not prime numbers. So apart from 2, every other prime number are odd numbers, and we need to keep that at the back of our mind.